Rush Limbaugh is in the house this morning. Rush, good morning. I'll, I'll tell you, John. Hang on, hang on. I need to explain who you are. Rush Limbaugh is a radio announcer that used to be on in Missouri, and then he yeah. became a nationally syndicated show after he named, changed his name. A big deal. And and he's on at pretty much high noon around the country, and he's a Republican talking head. Rush, good morning. Uh, uh, geez, John. I, it make me sound like some kind of a peckerwood. <laughs> what is a peckerwood? Here at the Excellence in Broadcasting Jenny, will you look Network. At, will you I'll look, look it up. Peckerwood yeah. uh, on pecker peckerwood on the we Urban don't Dictionary. Have announcers. We have uh, personalities. Can you believe the grief they're giving Kirshner this week? Wow, there's actually a definition for Peckerwood. What is the definition of Peckerwood? A white person, especially a poor one. That's it? That's it. That's it. That's all it says. Oh, what the hell did you think I said? I'm not sure what you said. Kirshner. They're pounding this guy oh. minute by minute, hour by hour on the Clinton News Network. Was that Sammy Kirshner that was the queen of my double wide trailer? Didn't he sing that song? She's the queen of my double wide trailer. Yeah, he did. That may have been his cousin Sammy Kershaw. No. Ah! Okay, so what's he have to do with Trump? Everybody's got a cousin in Little Rock. <laughs> you know, Bobo says he made love to Reba. Back in the 80s. I wouldn't doubt it. Mm -mm. It seems like her type. <laughs> he does not. Kirshner started with the, with the Donald J. Trump campaign. Oh, God. God bless him. As a, as a surrogate. Now, you're familiar with the term, surrogate. Well, sure. Another, uh, do you understand? I'm, I'm, I but look. It. What? Do you understand what that means? Yes. Not only was he working yeah. for the Donald Trump campaign, right. trying to put an end to the Cold War, the new Cold War, right. he's also fighting to get women the right to vote. <laughs> and that's important. I think we should have more surrogates <laughs> in Washington, D.C. Okay. <laughs> Old Washington. Washington. The Dirty River. The <laughs> Dirty River. Old Man River. Uh, Keeps rolling just through Washington. Rolling along. But Donald J. Trump's campaign is over. He's already the president, so uh, but look. What? Just Rush, let it go. Rush, on, on, on a more aggressive note, what uh, opioids are you going to take this weekend on Memorial Weekend? Good God, God, for the whole weekend? Yeah, I mean, for normally on the on the holiday weekends, you like to get all jacked up. Well, my, 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 my ex-old lady's daughter... Stole a whole bottle of hydrocodone oh, from my medicine cabinet, so I'm going back to good old Vicodin. That's serious. <laughs> Straight Vikies? It's always reliable. With, like, what do you like to drink with them? Absolute vodka. <laughs> oh, man. In a tiny glass. A little glass, yeah. And pretzels. <laughs> because you gotta eat. Well, you gotta, yeah. Carbs are important. So, Vicodin, like the big horse pill or the little ones? No, the tiny little cute little blue ones. So you take some one, two, three Vikies? And two and a half. Two and a half Vikes. At a time. And absolute vodka, like mixed or shots or chilled or up or down or dirty or what? In a glass. You don't need ice. It's Memorial Day weekend. Oh, sure. I mean, so you're not going to get any cooler than it already is. Straight up. Vicodin, and then what? You take your pretzel... And you dip it in the vodka. Oh my God! Uh, really? What are, what are you looking so shocked about? Well, that's just nasty. You've, done, you've done this. No, I can, I can see it. It's all over you. Not on purpose. And then you mash it up. Yeah. On a flat surface. Okay. You and snort, snort it. it. Oh God! Here we go. I knew it. I knew it. Yeah. Yeah. And you don't have to have a straw. Here, here's something I learned. Here's something I learned in the hood. If you've in got the hood? any dun denomination of dollar bill. I prefer a 20. You roll that up. <laughs> and that's the best way to get the pretzel down. Thank you, Rush Limbaugh. Thanks for uh, coming in this holiday weekend. Amazing. Remember, women should have the right to vote as well. Yeah, we Rob, good morning.